Community service has been its kuleana for nearly a century. More than a million people around the world belong to the Lions Club. KITV4's Mike Cherry reports from the Lions Club convention parade on Kalakaua. Waikiki is known to be a melting pot of culture. Today, it was the mecca of the Lions Club. They came from all 50 states. And from nations near and far. In all, roughly 20,000 Lion Club's members are walking the street of Kalakaua this afternoon. They represent 209 countries. Just imagine the economic boom that that means for the state of Hawaii. We anticipate that there will be a $90 million economic impact here on, on Hawaii and Honolulu specifically. One of my colleagues said that the reason why he was staying longer is this might be the only chance he gets to come to Hawaii, so he wants to go to Maui, he's going to several other islands, spending several weeks here. So I think that's where the impact comes because people come, they stay longer. Similar to the Olympics, Hawaii was awarded the bid to host the three day convention. Members say it's an opportunity to learn from one another on how to better their service to the community. We are all the same because we're lions in our hearts. And it's that we, are, we admit to the world that we'll never stop trying to make a difference. You know, we, we, where there's a need, there's a lion. You understand that better than New York member Rosemary Joyner. She lost everything she owned during Hurricane Sandy and says it's a civic duty to return the kindness she was shown during her time of need. For the holidays in New York, the winter is brutal. So what my club do is we gather coats and food and take for the homeless and the unemployed that are usually at the subway, at the track, and give away food to them and clothing that they can take home for, them, for their family. The convention comes to a close Sunday with Hawaii's largest bon dance, featuring at least 2,000 dancers at the Kapiolani Park Bandstand. Mike Cherry, KITV4 News.